In this video, I want to give you two ways of integrating two of my favorite funnel softwares, InfluencerSoft with Thrivecart. So if you have either of these tools, you owe it to yourself to watch this video and stay till the end to see two different ways of bringing these guys together. But before I show you how to integrate them, first, I need to explain why you should even consider doing this. And the reason is InfluencerSoft is an all-in-one platform, right? So it has the ability to accept payments and do everything all inside of its own system. So why would you ever consider using something like Thrivecart? Well, if you are already a Thrivecart user, then you know the value of this amazing tool. And because it is focused solely on collecting payments and doing upsells and all that stuff, it's extremely good at it. It's better than InfluencerSoft is. It just is, sorry. I'll give you four reasons right now of how Thrivecart is better than InfluencerSoft at the specific use case of collecting payments. And reason number one is it simply integrates with more payment processors. So if I come here to the integrations page of Thrivecart, it integrates in with both PayPal and Authorize.net. That'll make a lot of business owners very happy. And with their deeper Stripe integration, it also gives you things like Apple Pay and Google Pay, which is becoming even more ubiquitous in 2021. Another huge benefit of Thrivecart over InfluencerSoft for payments is the built-in affiliate program that you get with the pro level of Thrivecart. So if you want to get more traffic by sending your good customers in to go and bring more people into your funnel, you want a good affiliate program. It's some of the best traffic you can get. And when it comes to the best affiliate programs out there, Thrivecart's functionality is just fantastic. You can pay instantly. It can keep track of everything individual for you. You can let your affiliates have their own bonuses to make their affiliate offers like competitive. There's so many cool things you can do inside the Thrivecart platform that InfluencerSoft doesn't really have. Um, even to the point where if you want to automatically pay your affiliates, Thrivecart's where you want to be. Uh, InfluencerSoft is still working on it, but who knows, they've got a lot to work on, so that might not be on the roadmap for a little while. And there's also just more features, like more functionality inside of Thrivecart for selling, like being able to pay your own price, where you can like suggest $5, but they can pay you $10 if you want to. You can do automatic dunning for your subscription, so if somebody's credit card doesn't work one month, they can keep trying and like do all this stuff that's really hard to do, uh, but that's what they do, so they focus on it. Um, so a lot of benefits there to setting this up, okay? So if you already have have influencer soft and you're like hey this doesn't work with my payment processor i guess i need to cancel don't because this video is going to show you how to connect them together and if you have thrivecart and you're thinking like i want an easy way to connect this through and i don't want to have all these expensive expensive monthly fees or i want to have something that's very simple to use this is exactly for you all right so i'm going to show you two methods of connecting these together and the first one i'll call the simple method let's go ahead and dive in here and I, what i'm going to do is i'm going to create a new product let's just create a product here it's going to be a digital product I'm going to set it up for, let's just call this influencer soft connection. I'll leave it in test mode. Let's just give it a owner, a little test here. I'll set up a price for it. Let's call this $5. And here's what the really cool stuff. Like this is stuff you can only do in Thrivecart. So you really want to pay attention to this, you know, subscription, split pay, pay your own price, tons of options. We'll keep it simple here. All right. And then I want to come in. Uh, let's skip over bump offers for this video, but it will work just the same. And I'll use my stripe account and affiliates will skip over but again super powerful if you want to set that up now for this one all i want to do is when they buy i want to send them to a specific url let me put in my support information and i'll add a url expiration all right so the general strategy here what we're going to do is we're going to give them a special link where they can sign up for the course they just purchased all right so let's set that up inside of influencer soft by going to a new funnel and in this case, I already got started. So what I did was I pulled in an opt-in page and I basically just going to call this access your product. And then the thank you page will be the course itself. All right. So I've already created the course and um, you'll take a look at the course in just a second. And the general idea here is when somebody buys with your Thrivecart, um, with your Thrivecart purchase, they'll be able to come to this page, opt in and go straight to the course. Let's go ahead and show you how that works. I'll get rid of this one and let's rebuild it. So I'll come to opt in and I'll go to actions and you simply want to set up whatever list is in control of that course. And if you don't know what that means yet, I have my full review of influencer soft down below where you can check that out. So here I just made a list called test. Very, very fantastic. And I'll create the page. I have a very simple template already pre-built and I'll create this page. So in this case, I have it with a, another product already named in here. So I'll just change the name of the product. So thank you for purchasing the test course product. And then to add this to your account, simply fill out the form below and you'll get an instant link to the members area. I'll save this and get out of this page. And let me just put it into one of my actual URLs 
and connect this in. So when they opt in, I want them to go straight to the course. So I've selected my course. I've already had it pre-built, but if you don't have your product built, you can create one right here. And I can even preview what it looks like um, taking me to the first lesson here. All right, so I'll hit the save button. And what I wanna do is just grab this URL, grab this link. Okay, this is gonna be my very simple purchase page. And I'll come back to Thrivecart and when they buy, I just want to give them access to this link. And to make sure it doesn't get too out of control, I would recommend setting some sort of expiration timer. So give them a couple of days to sign up, give them a week to sign up, whatever you feel is appropriate, and hit next. We'll make a very simple page here. We'll go into the design. Well, I'll even skip over the design. You can design it however you want to, but I really want you to see the functionality here and how this works. And set up whatever tracking links and stuff you want to do here. And save and get the URL. All right, so let me just make sure that I've uh, saved and make this uh, made this funnel live, and let's go ahead and do a test together. So I'll open up the checkout page. All right, again, very bare bones. I did zero design in this, but this is my testing for the influencers off connection. Let me put in a, um, a new email address, and I'll hit continue. And then this is in test mode, so I'll put in a test credit card and complete my order. And now what should happen is it'll take me to the thank you page where I'll be able to like access my stuff. So it'll do complete. Again, no design work, so don't hate on me for having a really ugly design. But what's really nice is now I've got my invoice, I've got my ability to contact support. A lot of the things that I, right now Influencer Soft doesn't really do a good job of, uh, this kind of covers all those downsides. So now I'll click on, click here to get access to the, the product. So I'll click it, and that'll take me to the sign up page, and boom, I'll go ahead and sign up. The benefit here is if there's any typos, they can fix it and they can do what they need to do. And I'll say complete enrollment. And now what that does is it gives the person access to the list that gives them access to the course. And so now I can get in and I have access to the full course. I can finish it and bada bing, bada boom. It's it's rocking and rolling right there. All right, just to prove that that worked correctly, because you might be like, hey, well, maybe the protection's just not there. I'll open up an incognito window and try to access the same lesson. And you'll see it takes me to the login screen because I don't actually have access to it. All right, so that is the first, and I will call it the simple method. What's beautiful about this is you don't need to worry about all these direct integrations and setting up anything too funky, no web hooks. So it's very easy. Um, you can just pick a link that is like the signup page for that product. And once they make their purchase in Thrivecart, you can send them to the signup page. And then to prevent people from sharing it and going crazy, you simply put an expiration on that URL and you're good to go. So it's a fantastic way of using both Thrivecart and Soft for what they do best. Another benefit I just thought of is it also allows you to have like a mix of products. Like in most cases, when you're uh, integrating with Thrivecart, let's say we use Teachable for a lot of our courses. The downside is every product, like if we wanna upsell them an ebook, we have to make that ebook into a course inside of Teachable, which is a lot of extra, extra work. But because we're using the URL setup, you can have that URL be a direct download for an ebook, or it could be access to a course, or it could even be access to a calendar link to sell your services. So all of a sudden you're out of any pigeonholing, you're out of any like limitations. It's around what is designed to do inside of Thrivecart and Influencer Soft. All right, so that's the easiest way. I think that's gonna be great for 99% of you, but for that 1%, of fancy pants out there, we've also got the ability to set up a direct integration using Integrately. And if you haven't seen my review on Integrately, I'll put that down below as well. But let's go ahead and set up a brand new automation. What I'll do is I will go and I will look for Thrivecart and I'll select it and I'll also look for Influencer Soft and I'll select it. Now I'm gonna go ahead and create my own automation. So I'll say that when a product is purchased in Thrivecart, I want to add a lead to a group in InfluencerSoft. Again, remember, InfluencerSoft, everything is handled by the list that people are in. So if you want to give them access to a course, just add their email address to a list and boom, they've got it. So I'll do that and I'll say go. In this case, I'm gonna to go to the Automation Builder. And now what I wanna do is start setting up the integration. So step one is a product is purchased in Thrivecart. So I'll go ahead and add a connection. And I've got this webhook to add in. So I'll copy that. I'll come into my Thrivecart dashboard. I'll go to my settings down here to APIs and webhooks. I'll go to webhooks and notifications. And I can add one right here by simply calling this the Integrately plus Influencer Soft recipe. Name it whatever you'd like, but that's what this is doing. And I will save the webhook. Okay, so I have uh, created it. What it wants me to do next is go ahead and test and send some data to it. So I'll come back into my product and buy it one more time. And let's just do the same email address for simplicity. 
I'll say continue, put in my number, hit continue, and it should be good. So now it sent a test record. Let me go ahead and bring this back over here and test to make sure it worked. I'll say test connection and I'll hit refresh data. Boom, order success, tests all the details and it shows all the goodies of what we just did. The next thing I wanna do is add them to a group in Soft. so I'll select my account and I will select the email from the purchase email here. Just kind of find it, customer email, boom. Okay, and then so what list do you actually wanna add them to once they make the purchase? I'm gonna come down here and let's go ahead and pick out a list from what you've created for each product. So in this case, I'm just gonna use my good old fashioned test list. You can use whichever one is right for your product name, obviously. But the challenge is you only have this one recipe, so you have to make it like really work for you. So what I'll do here is I'll add a check condition after this, and I'll, I'm gonna do a series of ifs and else's, right? So, which field, I wanna make sure that the product is the correct product. So in this case, I'll say that if the product number, I, I don't wanna use the name because you might change the name over time. So I'll say if the base product is 100, so if the base product equals 100, that means it's the correct product in this scenario, right? So you'll be able to have a series of these go on um, and, and you'll be good to go. So if the base product is 100, then I want to add them to whatever list should be for that product. And then you can go through like an if else. So let's say you add the next product uh, down the road, you can do if else another. And so I would be able to go through here and say, okay, if it's not that product, it's going to come down here to the else. And then you can say, okay, if the product ID is maybe 101 or 102 or 103 and you can go through and actually have a single recipe that does all the automation work for you to make sure that all of your lists get put in correctly all right in this case we'll keep it simple let's get rid of this get rid of that guy there yes delete and let's hope this works i've been clicking around a lot okay so if the product is 100 then do that we're good so let's go ahead and do a test and it says test successful Whew. so i'll test and go live and it's gonna ask me to test each step one by one. So I'm just gonna do that. So test, test, and influences off is happy. We'll put this underneath my uh, lead flow and let's go ahead and run this guy. Okay, so to do so, let's go into our checkout page. I'll use a dummy email address. So I'll say test email integrately at gmail.com. I'll put in the, um, the credit card number here and I'll complete the order. So what should happen now is in Influencersoft directly, no, no need to do any additional signups, I should have a new user created as well as the tag for that test list. All right, so let's go ahead and verify if that worked. I'll come here to my leads, boom, test email integrately at gmail.com and they were added to my test list, boom. Sometimes you're worried doing these types of integrations, but when they work out, it makes you feel really good about yourself. All right, so what does this all boil down to? What this means is that you have the ability to get the best of both worlds. In all of my reviews, when I'm talking about all-in-one platforms, I do put that disclaimer out there that you have to be okay with sacrificing the best in breed functionality to get the simplicity of being able to do it all in one login, okay? And if you already have Thrivecart and you're like on the fence, should you go and invest in Influencersoft because you already have a really awesome tool, this video is designed to make sure you know like you can have your cake and eat it too, essentially. Almost knocked my drink over there. You have the flexibility and the freedom to use the best payment processing tool, as well as a very good all-in-one system for sending your emails and having your courses and doing everything else inside of uh, Influencersoft and not really have any complexity added. I will say the Integrately option is more complicated than the URL option. I was going through like, I hope this works on the first try when I was running it, but it worked. And if you have any questions, leave a comment down below. I'd be happy to help you. If you don't have Integrately yet, which is that kind of like powerful option there where you can do a whole bunch of cool stuff, there's a link down below to both the video where I review Integrately as well as my link to get an additional, I think it's an additional 500 tasks per month for free when you sign up, which we'll just save that for another day. Um, that's it for me today, guys. I hope this tutorial was helpful for you, shows you that anything is possible with enough patience and somebody like me on your side. I'll see you in the next one. Take care. Did you realize every time you hit like on one of my videos down below, it increases your conversion rates by 1%? Don't ask me how, it's science. So make sure you hit that like button, hit the subscribe button over there, check out more of my videos up here, and down here, grab the freebie that's made just for you. Thanks so much, I'll see you in the next video.